about uh, having the scrimmage here? Um, very happy to be here. Um, our team, our guys are very excited to be here and just to learn from a this is the ultimate team. You know, the armed forces, is, it's the ultimate team. And just to see how they do things and how they come together as one unit, it was big for us to see today. And just to experience, you know, I asked a lot of the commanders a lot of questions, so I kind of warm out today, I think. But um, it was an amazing experience. So I'm excited to be here and sharing this experience with those guys as well as our guys sharing it with them. So I'm excited. The thing that you want them to take away from this is what? Ultimate team. You know, ultimate team. I think... You know, talking to the commanders and just how they come together as one. You know, just just being as one, no matter what happens throughout the course of a practice or a course of a game. Like at the end of the day, you know what team you're on, and you come together as one. And you know, just talking today, that's that's the biggest thing, and that's the biggest value of being in the armed forces. So that's what it means to be together. No concerns. Hey, Coach, what is, uh, has anyone ever played in, like, a, you know, an environment like this, in a hangar with a plane behind you? <laughs> you know, it's actually funny. Um, I went to a few. Um, Nike had, they have their um, Nike camps and some hangers in L.A. So um, I've seen it done before, but it is cool. It's a crazy experience. And, um, I mean, it's very nice. I already see some of the guys were already saying they're struggling with the sight. Oh, There's yeah. A lot of air balls right Yeah. Of well, you know, in, in the NBA, the arenas, like, it's not an open space behind. It's the fans, and it's, you know, this is like more of like a college arena or playing at the Alamo Dome in, in San Antonio where it's no background. So it is kind of tough um, to shoot the basketball, but our guys will get used to it. Oh, very exciting. And we're also going to incorporate them into the practice. So it's going to be some three-point competition, uh, some different things for the guys to come out and show what they can do as well. Favorite part of today for you so far? There he is. <laughs> Sherman. I, I Listen, we had, we set the table, me, Kobe, Sherman. We talked to the guys about just different things, how long it takes to fly, miss with certain places, and just different things like that. And I mean... <laughs> it was I mean it was crazy like the stuff that we learned and had a chance to you know ask questions about and just the the airspace the space about the GPS stuff and just I mean I didn't know all this stuff I'm not gonna lie so it taught me a lot today I asked a lot of questions but sitting at the table with lunch um, with these guys was unbelievable and got a chance to learn a lot I mean my uncle's been in the Air Force for 30 years and I he ain't told me all this stuff so um, I learned more in one day being around these guys than I have being around him for. 41 years, so it's been great, though. I don't know. Probably, I mean, all together, probably about 30. Yeah, I think we, we had a bunch. Uh, we had a bunch oh. cool over there at lunch, and then we had different teams. On about around, 50? And we got about 1,300 folks that are going to be coming in here. Yeah. So, uh, it's, it's, it's a really good interaction. So, maybe it comes to more, and I think we're looking at a couple hundred, maybe some direct contact, uh, and then we're going to get a lot of great indirect contact out of this. Yeah, so been a lot of showing around, a lot of teaching, a lot of, it's crazy. The things that we think we got to go through in conditioning and, and working out to try to get ready for the season, to see what they have to go through is, you know, times 100. I mean, it's, it's, it's unbelievable. Has basketball career ever brought you to Dayton before? No. First time here. I mean, we haven't had a chance to really enjoy the city of Dayton, but having a chance to come to the base has been phenomenal. Um, hopefully in the past, we'll be able, I mean, in the future, we'll be able to get up here and experience more of Dayton, maybe have a game up here you know, in the preseason or something like that. So we'll see. Any drills you're going to take back with you to implement for the guys? I don't want to hear any complaining from our guys. They, they saw it firsthand, like what hard work really means and what it takes and the dedication to um, one common goal, and that's winning. And so seeing that today, um, I think our guys understand what it takes.